video is on multiplying and dividing by powers of 10. Uh, the first thing you need to know is with multiplication, when multiplying by a power of 10, you have to move the decimal to the right in order to make a bigger number. Because when you multiply, you should get bigger numbers with whole numbers. And then with division, you need to move the decimal to the left because when you want to divide, you want to get a smaller number. And moving the decimal to the left will give you a smaller number. So move the decimal to the left with division. Let's first do a multiplication problem. So here, multiplication, we need to move the decimal to the right. And since we're uh, multiplying by 10 to the third power, we're really multiplying by 1,000, we need to move the decimal to the right three spots. So originally we have 65 and 74 hundredths. And we need to move the decimal to the right three spots. Let me rewrite the problem down here. So we have 65 and 74 hundredths, and we need to move it to the right three spots because we have 10 to the third power. So we move it one, two, and we gotta make our last spot three. Now in this open area, right, right here, we have to put a zero because we had nothing for that. So let's put a zero in there. So now our basically our answer is 65,740. And it doesn't point there, but it's not necessary. So 65 and 74 hundredths times 10 to the third power equals 65,740. On our next problem, we're doing division. With division, we want to get smaller numbers, so we have to move our decimal point to the left. So here we have 254 divided by 10 to the second power. However, some people might not see a decimal in the number 254. Well, because there's no decimal showing, you have to put the decimal to the right of the ones place. The four is in the ones place, so we're gonna put the decimal to the right of the four, right here. Now, since this is division, we gotta move it to the left. We're gonna move it to the left two spots because our exponent is two. So let's take our decimal, one, two places, to the left, and we get our answer of 2 and 54 hundredths. So to multiply and divide powers of 10, with multiplication, you move the decimal to the left as many spots as the exponent says, and with division, you move the decimal to the, I'm sorry, with multiplication, you move the decimal to the right as many spots as the exponent says, and with division, we move it to the left as many spots as the exponent says. Thank you for watching my video on multiplication and division with powers of 10. Remember, this only works with powers of 10.